I think you're really going to like going to Hawaii this week, Gary. Do you think Walter brought enough sandwiches? I hope so. I really think you're going to like it, though. I think it'll give you a warm well, feel for the Pacific yeah. Ocean. Okay. Yeah. Well. Yeah. Hey, Wally. Mother Chucker, how you doing, guys? Chuck, been any bad movies lately? <laughs> hey, Wally. Just kidding. Still a step slow? I bet you oh. still have rhythm, though, don't you? Hey, I hope you're good. Oh, you see, look at that. You see rhythm? Hey, Walter, I guess this has to be like... One of the most exciting things you've ever done, taking two big celebrities like Steve and Gary all the way to Hawaii, huh? It's not like scoring a touchdown. Oh, sorry. We can put it into bitterness here. <laughs> yeah, I think this might have been a mistake. Well, well let's, wait now. let's get we on board anyway. Hey, uh, the third guy, who's that? Looks like John Wayne Gacy. I wouldn't go below in the cabin if I were you with him around. Next time people see us, we'll be poolside sipping on my Tai. Hey, you've got a nice butt. Did I ever tell you that? Hey, hey. Where are we? We lost Walter. Sweetness is gone. Who cares? Are you okay? That idiot had the slowest boat. I can't believe it took this long. I've ever been on. I can't believe it. Are you okay? Well, are you okay? No. <laughs> my God. Oh my God. We look like the Smith brothers. <laughs> And my good linen pants are ripped. <laughs> Four at the hotel. Those were your hottest slacks, dude. <laughs> Look at You're not going to be able to get into the disco dress like that. <laughs> dress like I need that. a whole new outfit and a shave. Where, How about you? Where the heck are we, anyway? Hey, we're at the hotel. Oh, cool. Go get me a Mai Tai, would you? A clip on Mai Tai. Wait, come back here and make love to me. From here to eternity. Come on, Burt Lancaster. I'm not that delirious. Hey, come back here. No way. my room? I thought so. Well, it is the nicest room in the hotel. When I was coming to Hawaii, I said, God, I'd like to have a room that says volcano, that says Pacific Ocean, that says water nearby, and they gave me the Fred Flintstone suite. It's only $35 a night, but I think I got the best room. It seems to have everything. Boy, am I glad you guys are here. I cannot believe the crummy room that I got, and I want people to see this because, you know, people say to me, they say, Steve, you're a big celebrity. I bet you get treated like a king. I want to show you something in your people. I want to show you how I'm treated, okay? Come on in. You know, I'm a big celebrity in Chicago. This is not, this is not the way it should be. You call this an entryway? Look at this. Look at this crappy art. Look at this. This is my office. This is my office. I can't, I can't do work in here. I'm claustrophobic. This is not a nice office. Look at this. The kid's bedroom back here. Hi, kids. Hi. Hey, you guys. What are you doing with a girl in your room? Nothing. <laughs> yeah. Sounds like me and your mom. Got the room service menu. Let's take a look at it. 
The Fred and Barney Burger. That looks good. Bam Bam Brunch. Wilma and Betty Buffet. And I'm near the water. That feels good, doesn't it? That sounds good. Although I have to go to the bathroom a lot. Just sitting here. Can I have one of your mints, please? One of your... What? One of your mints, please. You're getting claustrophobic being in here. I gotta get out of here. So let's hurry and get this over with. You call this a sitting room? You know, that's not even a full grand piano. It's a three-quarter grand. I mean, you know, I asked for some decent accommodations and I'm not being accommodated. Look at this dining room. I could maybe seat 12 comfortably. That's it. You know I throw big dinner parties. I'm having a miserable time here. Absolutely miserable. Mm. Sorry. I don't know, maybe this isn't the best room. Let's test out the bed. Gotta make that wake-up call. Hey! Right, come in, you call this a master bedroom? I don't. Look at this. It's only got two chicks on the bed. And what's that? What kind of a hotel is this? It's not a big screen TV. And it, you know, I am roughing it here. This is living. No, you can't use my phone order room service as a private room. This is the nicest room in the place. Get out of here. And then this. I mean, I got the same size sauna that the kids have. I mean, come on. You call that a sauna? You call this a room? You call this a hotel suite? You know, I'm sorry. I just thought maybe, you know, I had worked 17 years in the business of radio to get somewhere and be somebody. This is an insult. I have never been more put out in my life. That's all. That's end it. That's it. Cut it. I, that's it. It's over. Well, I think I got the best room. What's? Yeah, it's got to be better than Steve's room. It's got to be. I'll tell you. You know, I bet Gary has a full-size grand in his room. Actually, I know he doesn't. <laughs> I stuck him with the Fred Flintstone suite. I think he's got some drums in there made out of lava rocks and animal skins. That's about it. Yeah, thanks, Steve. They accused me of wetting the bed every night. It was actually a waterfall. Yeah, right, Gary. Mm -hmm. Hey, Dave, how you doing, man? Hey, Dave. You know, Gary and I are into a sport that, uh, well, a lot of people uh, don't know about, but it's... Uh, and it's if they a, did, they couldn't do it anyway. It's a hot new sport, and, <laughs> and it's called lava surfing, and we Simple. are... Simply lava surfing. And we're making actually a documentary like Remember Endless Summer? We're making one called Endless Third Degree Burns. Yeah, it should be out in about yeah. six, six, seven months. Yeah. Yeah, the cameraman, unfortunately, is in that burn center yeah. that Michael Jackson had to go to. Getting some skin grafted. Yeah. So anyway, what you do is you hop in a copter and uh, you head to, uh, to a volcano. First, uh, we don't go right to the volcano. No, you jump in. Uh, you jump into a waterfall. Uh, it's it's kind of a limbering up thing, kind of a loosening up thing, and uh, plus you get good and wet, and then you can, as we say in the business, make steam when I you like hit that. the lava. And here we go. Yeah. Whoa! Now this is really nothing. We're getting moist. Yeah. That's a and, no brainer. Uh, yeah. And we certainly don't have any. <laughs> Perfect for us. And there you can see I'm just uh, taking uh, as we I'm, I'm going over the falls as we say. Right. And uh, we're just just absorbing water right now. We head on over to uh, Took out a road there, to huh? a, what we uh, like to call a hot spot in the business. That looks good. Yeah. And we uh, we hop out of the copter. Whoa! Lava bunga! Plunk? Lava's up, dude. Whoa. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And we do some lava surfing. I'm right behind you. Here I come. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, hot, be hot. careful, man. Stay on your chair, dude. Oh, yeah. And uh, you usually end up on a nice beach. Sooner or later, that stuff's still hot. It's still a little warm. Still a little warm hot. to the touch. But sooner or later, you end up on a nice beach. And it's it's a brand yeah. new beach. Yeah. So no cigarette butts. No beer cans. No beer cans. I like, when, I like when Mother Nature takes off her jacket and does real estate for us. 
and that's what she's done here. She's taken, uh, she's taken off her jacket, she's rolled up her sleeves, and uh, here we are on a brand new beach after some lava surfing. And uh, the girls, if you could bring in those cocktails, please. Oh, yeah. These are women that live in the volcanoes. We call them hot chicks. <laughs> All right, that's a cheap joke. We're sorry. Would you soul kiss us before you leave? <laughs> For five minutes, that's all we ask. I'm going to cancel that cocktail service request. This is what you put up. That's you your wanna... cocktail flag. Put yeah. it down, dude. We're Thank taking you. care of. Just watch for that to go up again, because we're going to get thirsty. This is That's very hot. You better keep moving. Ooh, hot, ah, hot, hot, ooh, hot, ah, hot. Ooh. And next time, come back naked. Soul kisses. Come on. We were just up in the volcano. Life. That's nice. Whoa, that's a lot. So wow, look at that. You're not going to let me look at You had this thing just for an minute. hour Just now. a minute. There's a lot of uh, articles in here that I want to read. Let me look, look at it. Look at that. Look at that. Let me look How do at we it. do that? It's got to hurt. Yeah, I'd like to work on one of those shoots. Yeah, me too. Oh, look at that. <laughs> look at that. I'd work for that. free. Look, she's got goosebumps. Think it was cold? That water looks very cold. Yeah, yeah. Is that a goosebump? <laughs> no. Uh, well, sort of, I guess. Come on, let me look at it up close, huh? No, not right now. <sighs> well, here, I'll tell you what. I'm going to let you have it because... I'm going to take Thank a little, little rest here. Man, it sure would be cool to be around when they do something like that. Got that right. Those wow. hot babes. Wow. Hot sun. Sand on their butts. Wow. The Island Light is the perfect inspiration for the Sir Dal line of swimwear, soon to be seen on beaches worldwide. Oh, that's nice. That's real nice. Hey, Gary. That's nice. Gary. What? I think I have some sand on my butt. I like it. I like that look right now. Let's go with it a little bit. Come on. I think I have some sand on my butt, Gary. Contrasting colors brightly complement the beauty of this tropical paradise. This animal print would be right at home, either on the beach or in the jungle. Phew, this is it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This makes last year's and she looked like popping the mechanics. Come on. <laughs> Steve dreams away a perfect day on a spectacular piece of poolside. This suit should give him an unusual tan. You're making El McPherson look like Nell Carter. Yeah. Hurry before I get tan lines nice. like this. That's nice. There you go. There you go. That's what they want. They want that. <laughs> Give it to them. Okay. You know what they want. Ooh, right. Gary. This Aztec print in bold neon colors gives the phrase scenic attraction a brand new meaning. Come on, Steve. It screams you. You're on the cover now. That's the cover shot right there. Huh? No. No, I'll get that, that get that paintbrush away Wake from my up. butt. Hey, no, uh, what? Up. You're having what? a nightmare. Oh my God, Gary. Oh my What's God. Right? I had a nightmare. About what? A about you and a, a, a paintbrush and a lot of sand. Give me. I'm not done. Give me, give me it. No. Give me it. No. Give me it. Oh my God. It wasn't a nightmare. Oh God. Just make me wonder the 
You people are lucky to be staying at this resort because we have the one and only Stever the Doll Finn. I just have to remind you that you should not touch his eyes, his nose, or his blowhole. Uh, you can splash water in his face, he'll splash it back. Uh, play with the beach ball if you want with Stever the Doll Finn. Don't touch his eyes, his mouth, or his blowhole. You understand that? Yes, yes, yes. Sir. Okay. He's a little slimy to the touch, but uh, <laughs> don't worry about that. So I need five people that want to swim with the dolphin. Anybody? Okay, come on up. Let's go meet him. You can grab onto his fin for a while, but if he starts crying or whining, let it go. You can play ball with him. Just throw it at his face, and he'll hit it right back to you with his nose. Would you like to meet Steve or the dolphin? Sure. All right. Hey, Stever. Hey, hey, Stever. What the hell kind of noise is that? That's the call. Oh. Yeah. Go. Eee. Eee. All right. Look at him. Look at him play. He's amazing. He's Stever the doll fin. Stever, we have some people that want to swim with you. What? Some people want to swim with you. They won the lottery at the hotel here. You get their 55 bucks? Yes. <laughs> okay, just girls today, no guys. Really. All right, he's very temperamental today. He gets that way sometimes. All right, come on up here. We want to meet you. Huh? You come down here. I'm a dolphin. I can't right. get out of the water. <laughs> Not a salamander, for Christ's sake. Right. Why don't you go down and beat Steve or the dolphin? And now go on. Two or three minutes with the maximum. Go on, get around him, swim around him. Don't touch my nose, don't touch my eyes, and for sure, don't touch my blowhole. <laughs> Except Enjoy. maybe the women. The clock is running. $55 worth, right here. I hate it when they get behind me like this. What are they doing? <laughs> you know, that's a blowhole. It's not an eye in the back of my head. What are they doing? What with you? That's what they're going to do. I want the girls to touch me more. <laughs> Oh, he's slimy. I'll give me back some here. Oh, yeah. Uh, he's a little slimy. You know, I'm a mammal. He's very slimy. Look <laughs> how oh, slimy he is. That's algae. <laughs> That's all algae. Go ahead. It feels like, it feels like rubber. Rub his stomach. Look at his stomach. Look at his stomach. Look at his pink. The amazing Steve the dolphin. All right, your three minutes are up. We have okay. to say goodbye to Stever the Dolphin. Okay. Come on out. Bye. Wave, Bye. To, wave to Stever. Wave goodbye to Stever. <laughs> Bye, Stever. See you tomorrow. If not for the courage of the fearless crew, the minnow would be lost. The, the minnow, minnow would, would be lost. lost. Well, little buddy. What, Skipper? It's been nice knowing you. It's a fine cruise you've taken us on again. <laughs> the weather's a little inclement. Little? <laughs> the seas are a little high, <laughs> and so are we. Actually, this isn't a drink. This isn't a Mai Tai. I threw up in my glass. and I. Skip, hold, don't even say that again, okay? This. I don't want to hold that. <laughs> okay. Throw it over the side. No chumming. <laughs> we're, we're stranded on that island and need food. I think Skipper's a little sick. I, I'm a little worried. Skipper, are you okay, Skip? Huh? Are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. Oh, geez, I can't believe I drank that. Why are we going out during a storm, Captain? Hey, he's got to make a living. Captain George. <laughs> it rains here like nine days out of ten. 
What's Cap he gonna do? Sit around? Captain George is from Schaumburg, so he doesn't care. He's, you're from Schaumburg? Schaumburg, Pennsylvania. Oh, <laughs> we thought we had a local tie-in. <laughs> That's Sorry. Skipper. Skipper, what did you do? <laughs> Skipper. No, this isn't for TV. <laughs> okay, so when are we gonna see a whale? And don't make fun of my weight either. I mean it, man. Well, I'll, get, I'll get my money back. We're coming out here by Double Z Buoy, and that's where we saw some on the last cruise. And it's a good chance. Now they're on a track, right? Around. They're mechanical yeah, they're whales fake. on a track. And, and you, actually, you press a button down here, and they come up out of the water and swim around. Pneumatic ones with yeah. rivets inflated yeah. aluminum yeah. and stuff. We don't get you too close, so you won't see the yeah. aluminum. Yeah, cool. Like, like Disneyland. Disneyland. Not again. Phil. <laughs> 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 We were snorkeling and he just didn't want to ride back on the boat. He just left. Oh, I think we're losing Gary. Oh, geez. Well, that'll hose right off, won't it? Yeah. Uh, It'll hose right off. No big deal. So, uh, what, uh, what's the strangest oh, thing that's God. happened to you out here? Oh. Besides this. Having a whale stuck underneath the boat. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm going to get sick now. Oh, spouting. Harpoon ready! <laughs> Where's my chainsaw? Boy, was that disappointing. We made reservations with the hotel for what we thought was a whale slaughter. And it turns out it's like a whale sightseeing thing. And we're down here, and we're dressed in our slippers. We have our chainsaws and our travel cases. And uh, we come down here, and they won't take it. They say it's like a, a whale sightseeing thing, but what's the point of that? What's the point of seeing them if you can't slaughter them? Lipstick and perfume. Lipstick and perfume. I gotta get me some lipstick and perfume. Uh-oh. So, I don't know. Come on, where are they? Where are they? I hey, want one. Maybe we'll just wait out and see if we can find any. Lipstick and perfume. Got to get me some lipstick and perfume. Ladies and gentlemen, Jerry Lewis has a telethon coming up in September. Where is he going to get the grease for his hair if we are not allowed to slaughter a whale? Where are they? We want one. Come on, baby. Kick off the for me. Yeah, you're almost there. Come on, baby. I think we're the only non-Japanese guys here in this luau. These are just the landlords checking out another piece of property. <laughs> hey, if you want a good headache, go to a luau. <laughs> Number yeah, one, really. the drum with the solid monkey pot dancers. <laughs> and then there's pigs if they have roasting. I had a bad cold today. It's cleared oh, up. Gary. <laughs> Your hands. Your hands are telling a story, Gary. The story of a salad bar. You know, the Hawaiians first invented the salad bar back in the 1300s. As a matter of fact, when Captain Cook came ashore, Gary, he was greeted by the world's first salad bar, right. everything in monkey pond dishes. That's poi, you know. Yeah. Or wallpaper paste, I can't tell. It looks real appetizing. You know, Gary, my, my radio name used to be Lou Ow. These people must really hate us. <laughs> Look what we make them do. Hey. Put those uh, velour hats on it and bang on this for an hour while we eat. <laughs> I, can't, I can't eat this. I have to have a banana. It's asking it might settle my stomach. <laughs> you got nauseous just going through the line. There's a guy on stage right now wearing this on his head. They recycle all this stuff yeah. on stage. <laughs> yeah, and a girl with two of them. Like this. That's an outfit. That's an outfit. They're up there dancing with that on right now. So, um, I have to go to the bathroom. I don't doubt it. <laughs> I know it. I know it this there. pork goes right through me. I'll be back. Don't miss the show. Yeah, right. Her pork. Hey, there. Eh, eh. Doink. <laughs> <laughs>